Andover is now home to a brand new therapy centre providing a bespoke exercise service to help those with physical limitations and health conditions. The ICAN Therapy Centre is a specialist power assisted exercise facility. It's absolutely ideal for those that are inactive or deconditioned and looking to move more and mobilise but it's also absolutely perfect for those that may have a long term condition such as Parkinson's disease, MS or even post stroke to enable people to mobilise, work through their range of movement, uh, move more and feel better. Our ultimate goal is really to helping people maintain their independence for as long as possible. The community-based rehabilitation facility uses power-assisted machines, which means users can choose how to use it to suit their specific needs. But they're not only limited to those with health conditions. It can also be a benefit for people who've been inactive or deconditioned for a long period of time. The equipment that we have here will work the shoulder joints, the hip joints, the waist, the knees and the ankles. It has the potential to suit people of all ages and all abilities and where possible we will enable as many people as possible uh, to come and benefit us. And we've had some conversations with people um, who are concerned by their health condition or their disability and how we've approached that is really by inviting them along to come and meet with us, come and have a cup of tea, for us to meet them, greet them and find out about them and see where we go from there because I'm pretty sure that in this room there will be something for everyone. The seated climber is just one of the machines being used at the centre. It's absolutely brilliant for working your shoulder joint and mobilising your shoulders as well as your hips and knees and particularly when you put resistance into into that exercise as well it can really help strengthen your you know, the front of your thighs and also your arms which helps in everyday life from a, from that upper body perspective of reaching up into those high cupboards and also from the lower body perspective of getting up from the chair Dr. Sarah Payne, who is a well-known media campaigner following the murder of her daughter in 2000, is a pioneer of the centre and was at its launch. She knows all too well the benefits the specialist equipment can bring after she herself suffered a stroke in 2003. She works to, to, to modify and adapt handles, accessing the machines, um, given her own experiences and her limitations that have been. Um, she has a cross cycle at home and she, she's had remarkable benefit from this to the point where she's now able to, to lift her, her left shoulder and left arm that she hasn't previously been able to do following her stroke. The centre now hopes to build relationships with other community groups in the area who help local people with health conditions and physical limitations. Raya Barton, That's TV.